Summer camp just watched its trailer and have learned that it's not my cup of tea. Really, because <laughs> they are mainly focusing on camping and all, which sounded really fun in the beginning, but then I came to understand it's a movie made centrally for the older age group people. And also that it's releasing in theaters, which is a bit insane, and we'll talk about it later that why is it insane. So this trailer starts with three small girls who see each other after a very long time and so then and so then they go to this camp or perhaps meet there and there they have all kinds of fun that young people do such as chilling around and gossiping and you can imagine the rest so i personally would have loved to watch it someday if it was not just centered towards old people it's not that I have an issue, but the thing is this movie is purely a fun movie and you need to connect with the character and I don't think I'd be able to do it. And there is this one Italian movie that I've watched which was a rom-com and it also had some romantic scenes between some old characters but it was all sidelined. It wasn't the prime focus of the movie but still it gave those two characters enough time to develop some romantic connection. So perhaps in this movie they could have done the same thing. They could have infused some things that the younger generation people could also connect to. Or if they want the prime focus to be on the romance between old people. So if that's the case then they should have taken some inspiration from this movie that recently came, Ticket to Paradise, starring Julia Roberts and George Clooney. If you haven't watched it, you can definitely watch it. It's a fun movie. Even though the focus was entirely on them and not on the romance between their daughter and this other guy. Still, the best thing was that I only was interested in watching more and more scenes of Julia Roberts and George Clooney's character. So that is what the most amazing thing is. You have to make people crave what they want to watch, even if it's older people or it's younger people. And their chemistry was something else which I already felt while I was watching the trailer of Ticket to Paradise. And here, in case of summer camp, nothing much appeals to me. No scenes, nothing seems to be striking out. Except for this wonderful cast, such talented actors such as Kathy Bates and Diane Keaton have been cast in this movie. And this is the only thing that can save this movie from bombing in theaters. And I don't get this, why the heck are they releasing this in theaters? It doesn't make any sense as their target audience would be way lesser and even from that audience, only some would be interested in watching the movie because I don't see many old people going to theaters these days. This could easily have been a huge hit if they would have added some romance between some younger generation people as well. Perhaps they could have brought some children of these characters and showed some romance as well that could have easily opened a huge doorway to wider audience engagement so that could have made this movie successful but as far looking at the trailer i don't feel at all interested in watching it have you watched this trailer if you have what did you think about it be sure to comment down below and do not forget to hit the subscribe button if you like this video and you want to watch more stuff like this and thank you so much for watching my video and supporting my channel and as always may the force be with you